một bên là nền văn minh cổ xưa phương Đông, một bên là cái nôi của nền văn minh phương Tây. Hey, how you doing? It's Tom, and it's the Tom's Radio Room Show, and I'm excited because I'm getting China Radio loud and clear. Unfortunately, right now, they're broadcasting in Vietnamese, so I don't speak Vietnamese very well. <laughs> Not at all. But one thing that came to mind is I was thinking, why all of a sudden... Uh, am I now receiving from China where a half hour ago I was not? And the reason I think it is, is because of the, right here, the gray line. This is the gray line. This is showing you what's in darkness and what's in daylight based on where the sun is. And on short-wave.info, one of my favorite websites for finding shortwave stations, it shows you that map with an updated gray line based on when you just did the search. So I just did a search, and what I did is I did a search on the 31 meter band. And by doing that, I could see all the broadcast at this time on the 31 meter band, not just the ones in English. So using this option, it doesn't, this stuff up here doesn't affect it at all. So I'm seeing all the broadcast and it shows me the stations on the map and the gray line. So right now, I'm coming up on sunrise. And right over here, they're coming up on sunset, which as far as that parameter in shortwave listening, that's the ideal time to listen to stations that are around the world from you. So you can see uh, right in here, like 9470, 9560, so on. So I can come down here and look up 9460. <laughs> and I don't see it. I could have swore I said 9460 up there. Ninety four seventy. Okay, so I can come down to ninety four seventy and here is uh two stations one close by and one on the other side of the world in China. So I could tune to 9470 right now and possibly receive something as that gray line approaches me. So let's go to 9470, 9470, and nothing yet. And the gray line is still approaching me See, I'll update this when we do a refresh. Yeah. And it's only been a few minutes, so it hasn't moved much. But, I can, wait, there's a 9470 right there. Let me go down there. Did, did I see that one before? 9470. Yeah. W-E-W-N in United States. So there's two of them there. Uh, at least, yeah, two. Or I could go to 9480. We go to 9480. No, nothing there yet. Yeah, I can say the gray line. Hmm, something trying to break through. Let me turn a sink off. So the gray line hasn't quite gotten to me. So there's this period of about an hour or so, uh, right around sunrise, and it's different for, you know, of course, wherever you are, it's gonna be different. And, uh, hmm, <laughs> this is getting kinda exciting. Look, there's a 9570 up here in Alaska. 
Let me go down and see that. 9570. Anchorage, Alaska. Anchorage Point, Alaska. World Christian Broadcast. That's interesting. Uh, you know, that's, people are telling me all the time, there's nothing on short wave. But that's, that's not true. It's just with the solar under, the solar index, solar flux index. I'll get it right in a minute. I'm so excited. Um, it's just been in the crapper, but it's up to 140 now and increasing every day. And sometimes it falls back. So the shortwave bands should light up. Now, here's another one. There's a whole, look at all these stations. I got dozens and dozens to choose from. Here's Radio Taiwan International. I've gotten them before. Um, 9490, Let's see what's up there. No. Now I can hear something really weak. So if I hang around here in my shack until that, let me go back up to the map again. So that gray line is over me. Now where did I say that was? 9470, no 9490, it's in Taiwan. So I've missed the gray line is going away from Thailand, which is over here. So I've kind of missed that. So I can kind of approximate when, because it's approximately one hour before and after the gray line is over you is when you're going to get good receptions from stations on the opposite side of the world. So you got about a two hour window there. So I'm coming up probably within an hour. Let's see, it's 6.35. Yeah, uh, sunrise here in Clearwater, Florida is about 7.35. So I'm within that one hour. So I could pick out some of these stations here, like 9690. So it's going across the earth. And so these stations are just coming into the gray line. Let's see what's at 9600. 9600. 9600. Uh, PBS and let's look, since it's in China, but let's look on the map and zoom out. Yeah, so it's right in the middle of this area right here, which the gray line is approaching or just past this area. So theoretically, I may be able to receive something there. Now let me go back and 9490, where'd it go? 9490, 9490. That's Radio Taiwan. I missed that. Uh, what was the other one I said it was coming up? Oh my gosh, my memory's so bad. Um, see, in this area right here, 90, 9470, 9470, 9470, 9470, yeah. That's in the eastern, excuse me, eastern part of China. And what am I getting? 94, oh, it's 9470. I'm 94.9. Nope. Nothing there. We tune around the band around here. Ooh. Oh my gosh. 94, 94, I mean, excuse me, 94 and 40. That's loud and clear. Is that listed? Yeah, a China radio. Wow, that's booming in.
I guess you could say that's music. That's booming in. The S meter is only about a five or six, but the audio is strong. Wow. And that's out of China someplace. Let's go down a little further. Wow, that's close. Nine, three, three, three. Uh, I saw it. Here it is, right here. Yeah, WBCQ. Something right there. 9270, kind of weak, but it's there. Okay, that's below the 31 meter band. Okay, anyway, um, I just wanted to show you that's another thing you can look at on this short dash wave dot info website is select a band or any of these other options up here like I could select any station broadcasting in English right now click go select go it would show me the map plus the listing and there's all the stations that right now are possibly broadcasting in English throughout the band and you can see the gray line is over here in Eastern I think this is considered Eastern Eastern China so here's a bunch of frequencies I could try let's just try one and then we're done 7250 and it's there, but extremely weak. So, anyway, just another little tidbit on trying to receive shortwave stations. If you enjoyed this show, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, I'm almost up to 15,000 subscribers. Yay, big deal. Have a great day. Bye-bye.